If you are watching this, um, I don't recommend getting it. <laughs> I'm not talking about hanging it up. It's it's just a lot. I'm literally stressed out. Oh, yeah. Okay, now we're dancing. Um, yeah, this is probably nothing we sent back. Oh. I'm like, girl, you need to get new friends. Quickly, I uh, um, fresh face, put on a little bit of primer. to my channel today's video as you can see from the title it is going to be the start of another vlog but what type of vlog no idea but if you're new here hey girl my name is Akira Janae don't forget to subscribe and join the family before you leave so as you can already see nails toe up <laughs> um I do have to go get my nails done my birthday is this Thursday Leo gang period August 1st um and yeah my week has been started off very 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 bad um <laughs> I did have this vlog kind of like mapped out in my head how I wanted to basically start it off and basically just how I thought this vlog was going to be and it's not. Um, so today is, what's today? Tuesday, July 30th, 10.32 in the morning. Um, I'm only up because maintenance had came in this morning and I put in two maintenance requests. I put in a maintenance request for my water filter to be changed that always have to be changed every six months. So it was time for that to be changed. And then... That's why I say it started off horrible. Sunday morning, or I guess Monday morning, if you will, because um, he came and changed that yesterday. Monday morning at like 2.30 in the morning. I think, okay, I got off work Sunday morning, y'all know, I work overnight 12 hours. Got off work Sunday morning, um, came home with the sleep, woke up at like 5, 6 o'clock, was up. I did a Sunday reset, all of that deep cleaning and stuff late at night. I didn't get done to like 2, maybe like 1.30 in the morning. Um, my boyfriend was like, literally don't matter what time of the day it is, you're going to clean. That's true. So I did that. I didn't record for YouTube. I recorded it for like short form content. So I am going to post it on YouTube, but it's not going to be like a full vlog. It's going to be like a little, you know, short clip. So yeah, I did that. So I lay down, get all comfortable, whatever. Like, all right, it's 2.30. Let me just make myself go to sleep because I wasn't sleepy. Took my sleeping pill, lay down out of nowhere. Probably about like 2.30, 2.45. The smoke detectors, fire alarm, whatever is going off. Well, the smoke detectors are going off. And if y'all know, if y'all been here for a minute, y'all know that every so often, I think last year it happened about four times, or between last year and this year it happened about four times, where our smoke alarms and stuff like that will go off and the actual fire alarm will go off. So I didn't hear the fire alarm, but I heard the smoke detectors. And I'm like, I jump up like, what is going on? Is something on fire? So I'm running in all the rooms, you know, checking all the plugs, the outlets, you know. I didn't light no candles, I knew that. Um... And I only had one candle warmer plugged up. So, like, I just ran through the house checking everything. Everything's good. And it just stops after, like, maybe a minute. Okay, lay back down. Get comfortable. It happens again. That happened four times between 2.30 in the morning to 5 o'clock in the morning. I didn't get any sleep Monday morning or Sunday night going into Monday morning. I had a dentist appointment by my Invisalign um, Monday morning at 11. Didn't go to that. Want to know why? Um, I originally canceled because I was just tired or whatever, but also my tire is flat. If y'all know, y'all know. This is going to be my third or fourth flat tire. Um, <laughs> I just, I just don't know what's wrong with the freaking tires. Um, somebody on my YouTube channel, I can't remember y'all name, but y'all commented. I remember y'all specifically commenting on at least three different videos asking about, the car let me see if i can find it because i didn't reply back to it for that reason y'all don't have like a name or anything but i hope you are watching this if you're the subscriber <laughs> who commented this um on the picture it just has a letter m so i'm gonna assume your name starts with the m but it's like just user zs7 ts whatever um you commented on my video when i got my new car in 2021 and said one of my favorite videos i'm still believing in manifesting this um, in Jesus name, you know, all of that. And then you're asking, you had also asked, you know, do you like it? Just asking about the car. Um, I love my car, but I would never get it again. <laughs> and I'm gonna tell y'all why. Um, I was thinking of getting my exact car in a 2025, the KK5, whatever, the new, the new improved version with the panoramic, you know, little, all of that jazz. You can go look it up. 
and I literally y'all know how I be telling them to stop calling me like I'm not training my car I don't want to give you my car like I want my car this is this is my car there's not another car honestly out there besides two other cars that I would like to have so yeah at this point I'm over it um like I said this is like my third or fourth flat my car has literally been sitting outside since I got off Sunday morning walk outside Monday complete flat tire and this is the same tire that my boyfriend had put air in if y'all remember in the last vlog and it's you know it, it seemed fine so i'm over it um i've never had this many problems with the car as well as y'all know the tires keep messing up um my air is out still i'm not fixing it um it goes in and out so right now it's not working but hopefully within the next few days or week or whatever it'll just miraculously pop back on and i'm giving them back this car so if you are watching this um i don't recommend getting it <laughs> like everybody's um perspective obviously is different on whatever car they have you hear good things bad things about everything it's just you know if you're lucky or not so in my personal opinion for me my luck has been horrible with kids my best friend had said yesterday when i sent her the picture she said i was told kids are bad cars a long time ago it's just hard for me to believe that this ish is happening and this car is new af if you don't know i got my car in 2021 i have a 2022 kia k5 um brand new off the lot zero miles on it literally still had the plastic and everything in there to peel off my car is brand spanking new i only have 30,000 miles on it and i got it in 2021 like brand new i don't go anywhere the only long trip that i took in that car was to i want to say i took my car to dallas in 2022 that's it um even though i don't know if these are like minor problems or whatever but these are just problems that i feel like i shouldn't have i used to have a 2014 hyundai ascent um and i had one flat tire and that was because i ran over a nail you know like my tires weren't just going flat <laughs> like as far as i know i didn't really run over anything but i guess we'll see i probably want to take the tire to see if i can get it like temporarily fixed fixed or something because i don't have no money for no tire right now um so yeah, my tires are like 230, 240, and they're, they're high as hell for no reason. Um, so yeah, I just can't take it anymore. So I sent my boyfriend two cars that I would like to go test drive, and they are blowing my freaking phone up. This is why I hate putting my information in with car companies and stuff, because they just will not leave you alone, like, at all. And I was just, I put in my information specifically just to see what my, like, what I would get for trading my car in. But anyways, I sent him two cars. Um, I sent him a range rover and then i sent him a porsche it's not really the color i want so the range rover is this one um it's literally a used car i'm not really going to be picky about getting a brand spanking new car right now especially because this one only got eight thousand miles on it if i do end up going with this one so this is a 2024 land rover so we'll see what they could quote me at and then the porsche is a 2020 um porsche i don't even know how you say it um i don't know if it's cayenne cayenne whatever i'm pretty sure y'all will correct me down in the description box like y'all always do but this one's cute um these are literally the only two cars that i like and that i would want um it's funny because i actually well i'm not even gonna tell you that but yeah so i'm gonna go test drive them this only have 10k miles on it so that's perfectly fine for me um I'm gonna go test drive them because I haven't I've been inside of a Range Rover before but I never driven one so I do want to at least go test drive that in the Porsche to kind of see you know what's my vibe what am I feeling um kind of like how I did when I literally just randomly went and test drove my uh like the Kias and stuff me and my mom went to go look at them and I don't know if I got it that exact same day or I had came back and then literally I had got the car so I don't plan on getting a car today this week or whatever like that but I mean hey this may be a blessing and blessing in disguise so we'll see but I do at least want to go test drive those because you know I need to see what type of car that I want um so yeah that's that so that's how my week has been starting off horribly as well as i originally planned to go to chicago for my birthday this um this week yeah that didn't play out so then i planned on going to hot springs if you guys are local that's about like 50 minutes to an hour away um from little rock we were actually going to stay there until like the entire weekend uh, i'm going to the spa there we're going to eat at this restaurant that i um really fell in love with going for the first time on around valentine's day 
yeah that's out the window so I am still gonna go to the spa there they had I just called and confirmed my appointment it said 10 o'clock but she said I can arrive an hour and a half early so I'm literally gonna have to get up at like 7 30 because it's gonna take an hour to get there and then she said we can um utilize all the amenities that come with it so she was like bring a bathing suit we recommend and you know just all the cool stuff there so if i can vlog i'll vlog i may not bring my camera i'll probably take in my um phone to try to get a quick little bit of footage because obviously it's going to be you know women in there <laughs> like you know undressed naked all of that type of stuff um so yeah i'll just try to get quick little cute maybe like pictures or clips or something but yeah at this point i don't even feel like vlogging my birthday like I'm going to dinner. Um, I was going to go to dinner there. Anyways, plans change. I'm going to go to the spa. We're going to have fun there. And we're going to go to this wine tasting place that I do want to go buy this specific wine from that you can only buy in Hot Springs at the winery place. Um, so I'm going to pick that up and then we're going to come back. My dinner isn't until 7.30 now. Um, we're going to eat at Sullivan Steakhouse if you're local. Um, me and my boyfriend went there for our two-year anniversary last year. Really, really good. Like the best macaroni and cheese I've ever had. Um, so I think I want to do, I don't know if I want lamb chops or a steak, but I want to go there too. I decided there because um, they do give you like a cute little birthday card and stuff. Like how they took me and my boyfriend picture um, for our anniversary. So they literally took our picture for our two year anniversary there. And I thought that was super cute. Literally free, didn't cost anything. So hopefully they take another picture. <laughs> but I do know I saw on the reviews they did give you a little birthday card and stuff. So that's why I like them. They're really nice there. The atmosphere is cool. You don't have to, you know, pay extra gratuity and stuff like that. I'm only gonna have a party at seven. So yeah, that's the plans. Um I'm blessed to see another birthday, thank God. Like, you know, I'll be twenty six. Most people don't get to see that. Um it's just I'm just kind of over the birthday festivities and the plans. Um I know next year and stuff and from here on out I don't wanna have to plan anything like i want to just tell you where i would like to go eat and i would just want somebody else to take over because it is stressing me the hell out on top of like my car problems and trying to plan this and my boyfriend i don't try to get agitated or whatever but me if you start to ask too many questions and stuff and i'm trying to just figure things out it do get to annoy me and i know he means well and i did apologize and stuff it's like and he even said like he's not trying to ask too many questions because you know how i get just overwhelmed and just it just gives me anxiety and stuff and i hate it so from here on out, I'm gonna have to have just somebody else just plan some stuff for me because I literally can't take it. Um, it just drives me insane. So yeah, that's what's going on. As well as my outfit that I wanted to wear, it's coming from Fashion Nova. Um, it's nothing extravagant, like not no custom birthday dress outfit or anything. Um, I got one dress and then the other one, I don't know if it's a dress or a two piece, like a top and a skirt that kind of look like a dress. And then I got two pair of jeans and this corset. So I was thinking of maybe wearing the corset because I thought we were going to stay. Original plans was to stay in Hot Springs and then after I go eat dinner, we were just going to go to the casino. So jeans and like a corset is more, you know, I feel like I'll be more comfortable in the casino and just like some jeans and a cute top or whatever. So either way it go, I don't know. So I do have one. I ordered them separately too. So one package is going to be delivered today. And I don't know about the other package. Um, I think it's the corset and the jeans that's coming today. And then I'm still waiting on my dress. So my birthday is Thursday. And that's also why, you know, like we're not going. We're supposed to leave out tomorrow morning, which is Wednesday. It is just, y'all, it's just so much. So I'm waiting on a freaking birthday outfit. Hopefully that fits and I don't got to go to try to find anything else. It's it's just a lot. I'm literally stressed out. And it's just driving me insane. So I'm waiting for him to wake up. He did work last night. Um, I'm probably just going to go ahead and clean up my um, this room in here that I'm filming in. My um, YouTube studio room. Because I deep cleaned everywhere else. And yeah, I do need to eat. I haven't ate today. I really don't have anything to eat because I got to go grocery shopping. But I don't got a car to go grocery shopping. I know I'm throwing a lot at y'all right now. But I just got to get it off my chest. <laughs> I swear, growing up, when your parents be like, if it ain't one thing, it's another, I swear, mama and dad, I understand what y'all mean. <laughs> like, if it ain't one thing, it's another, straight after each other. So It's hot as hell, but we're at the Kia dealership. I just test drove a uh, um, Range Rover. I absolutely love it and want it. It's just, baby, that price gonna have to come down a little bit. And I need my lashes done because, girl, why only got one lash on its eye looking crazy as hell? So, 
yeah bae about to test drive this car right here you know not telling too much but you know we just test driving and then i'ma go um test drive the porsche after he test drive this one this is gonna be our family car because we want three kids so yeah that's what we doing he got a truck right now but he kind of wants something that's obviously not a truck kind of enclosed area so yeah it is july 31st the day before my birthday 4 13 in the evening i went and got my nails done today didn't vlog because yeah i'm just i'm just not feeling it this week like at all um and i don't like them i feel like the white is too thick i told him it was too thick he erased a little bit and then it's still too dang thick so i'm just over it um i'm gonna do my toes and stuff myself and i do gotta pack up this hair this is for Yara. Janae had just came and bought some hair yesterday. Um, so yeah, this is uh, the virgin hair that I sell. I sell raw and virgin hair, but this is the virgin hair. So it already comes with basically pre-packaged and everything. So I just gotta put it into my box and stuff. Um, I'm pissy right now because one, I have not ate today. It's four o'clock and I'm just not cooking me some breakfast. Two, obviously y'all know i don't know if i told y'all but i got a flat tire um i went and looked at cars and stuff yesterday i think i told y'all that i don't know but yeah my tire is flat once again this is like the third or fourth time super over it over the car still don't have any air in there so i've been burning the hell up all day um i'm just i'm just over you know when, when people get hot especially black people when we get hot and it's just it's just be too much so by the package of this order finished cooking my breakfast quote unquote <laughs> um and yeah i got my stuff from fashion nova um i ordered like four things to try to wear for my birthday tomorrow um to the place that i originally didn't even want to go anyway so i got this dress which is cute but i don't know it's just not it's just not giving birthday right now like i could definitely wear it but i feel like i would have to wear a sewing with this because my show is just too bare up top for me so she's cute i'm gonna keep this dress it kind of gives like wedding guest as well so that's something like it's not really giving birthday especially since the setting kind of like the setting that i'm going to um i bought these pants from fashion nova which they're super cute um i was going to wear these but it's just not going to work out um these are a size three and they're so small um i forgot fashion nova their stuff to me runs small and Shein runs big to me or like more so true to size um I don't know what it is with Fashion Nova. I just feel like they be making stuff for, you know, unrealistic body types most of the time. So this little size three, yeah, it's way too small. So um, I'm just gonna send back both of these pairs of jeans that I got. I got these as well um, in their size three, which I, something told me just to order a size five anyway. So I need to return those, get a size five. Um, then I also ordered the two piece. The two pieces like really low cut down here whatever y'all know i got a triple d which i had boob tape on but it, it's just too much like it's way too much and nothing i just feel like nothing looks right on me right now it's, i'm i'm just not feeling it um <laughs> and to the point where i almost cried because this have this has literally been the worst entire like birthday week or whatever of my entire life um so yeah, I'm, I'm not feeling it. I'm ready to freaking go eat my dinner, come back home, and then work on some YouTube collabs and things like that. Because at this point, it's just nothing's going right at all. Um, so yeah, I'm just not feeling it. And tomorrow for my birthday, I'm not sure if I'm gonna record or not. I'm probably gonna bring my small camera. Wait. I'm probably gonna bring my small DJI just to record a little bit, like I said. I'm literally going to go eat nothing special tomorrow morning i do go for my massage they said i can get there i think i don't know if i told y'all get there about an hour to an hour and a half early to um utilize all the amenities and stuff that they offer so yeah i'm literally going to the spa i think i did tell y'all because i ain't gonna be obviously able to record because pretty sure people will be dang they're naked in there or whatever so yeah that's what my birthday consists of i'm ready to blessed like i keep saying blessed to still be here that's not what i'm saying it's just plan wise i'm just ready to get this over with because none of my plans have been panning out the way that i wanted them to pan out 
so yeah i'm just over it um uh, boyfriend had called me earlier but he was um anyways he had called me and i just i wasn't in the mood to talk like everything is just horribly going wrong right now and i guess he could pick up on it obviously because he was like pick up the phone because he facetimed me and i kind of had the phone at the ceiling because you know i was trying on stuff but it's like if you don't feel good or look good like you know you don't want nobody else to see this so i'm like no i'm not about to show you the outfit because you know i don't like it it doesn't look right so whatever he was like he had to make a call to one of his friends but he ain't called me back yet but it's fine because i really don't want to talk right now um and i'm trying not to cry <laughs> trying not to be that grown but it's just like I mean, I thought my 26th birthday was going to be differently, but you know, whatever. Still forever blessed to be here. Another day on earth, another birthday. So, cheers to that. Yeah, I definitely got to do my hair. Hey y'all, today is my birthday and I just got my massage. We are- Starting route to Little Rock. <laughs> we are leaving the casino and they gave me this little card thingy or whatever, so I'm about to open it. My massage was a 10 out of 10. It was the, how do you say this? Astro Spa here at the casino resort. My lady was Kayla, I believe. So I said her name. It says Miss Baker. It was a pleasure to welcome you to the Astro Spa. Happiest of birthdays. I hope that you continue to have a lovely day, Kaylee. Super sweet. So y'all go see my girl Kaylee. I told her I'm gonna have to start making this like a monthly thing or something because it was amazing. She literally massaged from scalp to toe. So it was really, really good. And now we're about to go back. Well, no, we need to go to the mall. And then we're gonna go to, what else did I say? I need to go to Forever 21. I can't remember where else I started to get to go. And then we're gonna go back to the house and I'm going to get ready for dinner and stuff because honey, I gotta get all of this together. This, I can't look up, look, I can't show up looking like this. Hey I'm back home now, it's 1.48. Uh, we went to the mall and stuff to try to see if I could find me something else to wear because I didn't like anything that I got from my Fashion Nova haul or whatever. Um, so I went and picked up my Ulta gift from my best friend Nikki. She um, basically bought it online and then like had me go pick it up here because you know, she don't live here. She was in the military, my girl left me. And they gave me flowers last night. Um, along with his big old card. This card is from my dental office. They literally mailed it to me, which is so sweet. I already showed y'all from the spa. They gave me a card. All right, and then my boyfriend couldn't wait. He had to give me <laughs> the Sephora gift card as well already. I'm the type of person who kind of likes to just open up all my gifts at once um, instead of just having them throughout the day. I don't know, but I think it's $75 on here. So we're gonna go ahead and get to what my best friend got me from Ulta. I'm gonna pull this out because I did pick this out from my birthday gift. Um, it's just a body, a body polish. Um, I haven't been makeup shopping and all of that in a while. So bear with me on these brands and stuff if I do not know them because I do not freaking know. I do not freaking know how to say the name of this. I'm just gonna have it track my face because yeah got this um body polish in this brand i can't really smell it because all i smell on me is the oil from my um <laughs> massage that she used so like that's what i smell like that all like aromatherapy or whatever okay she gave me a receipt for it. it's a gift receipt for that and we're gonna go ahead and get into this this is the biggest thing that i see it is a skin gym, <laughs> um, Cyro Chill face mask, a ice facial bead mask. Oh, this is cute. So you just put it in the refrigerator, get it cool, and then put it on your face. See that? I just got a package as well. It's a collaboration. Okay, hold on, we'll come back. <laughs> Um, 
This is a collab. It came in a two piece. So that other box is outside. It's way too heavy. So I'm just gonna have my boyfriend bring that in, which he normally brings in all the boxes when he's here anyway. So yeah. All right, get into the other goodies that I got. I got the Ordinary Niacinamide 10% and Zinc 1%. Um, I am actually running out of this, so I'm glad that she actually gave me this. Yeah, so I already have this, and I literally am running out. There's not much left in there. Next thing, this is heavy. This is God is a Woman by Ariana Grande, a body scrub. Dang, if I knew she would have... Dang, I wouldn't have got the uh, <laughs> body scrub, but you can never have too many body scrubs. This looks hefty, but I don't like that it's kind of... You know, this one don't look too good. Organic coconut oil and shea butter. Yeah, I can tell that shea butter is in there. Super cute. Tell me if y'all used this before. Other thing I have is the lip gloss. I love this lip gloss. This one has the um little like glitter in it. I already got lip gloss on. So yeah, I already got Summer Fridays on, but I do love this lip gloss. That one has the glitter. And then this one, oh, this is a pink one. I've never got one with the pink tint to it. I can't wait to try this tonight. I may use this tonight for dinner. So she gave me both of these. And then I got a few face, a more face mask. So this is a bubble sheet mask. Cleanse and exfoliate. This is some other little face mask. And then this is a Neutrogena Hydro Boost. Oh, I love Neutrogena. And yeah, that's what she got to me for my B day. Lady at Ulta was like, oh, you got good friends. My best friend, I barely even get a um happy birthday for mine. I'm like, girl, you need to get new friends. <laughs> like, what do you mean if your friend not even telling you happy birthday? Get it together. Supposed to be eight items. All right, so I am using this little lash cluster kit from Shein. This is what it looks like. Um, these are the lashes. So I'm trying to do them myself. Basically get myself a fill in because y'all know I went and got them done. But I only literally have this little bit left. And then I'm trying to fill it on this other side. And for my first time, I think I did okay. I don't really feel it under there i'm not trying to put it too close you know to my lash line because i don't want it to be ir irritating y'all were right some of y'all said it's easy and some of y'all said that y'all usually do it to yourselves so um yeah i'm trying it out and so far so good like i said i don't really care if it'll last long or not um i just want it obviously for my birthday. First few were easy. Now since I want to do it on camera, of course it's gonna F up. Oh, straight and even? No. But do it look okay? I think so. <laughs> yeah, but it's much better. All right, we're done. This one is a little bit longer. Right now I'm trying to add in some of this like curly hair up here um, because I think I accidentally pulled it out. So I literally have a threading needle, like the type of needle that you sew hair into your head with. And I just thread it like the actual curly hair into that. And then I'm about to try to like tie it real quick um because i don't know what else to do <laughs> i need like a crochet thing i saw a girl do that before i need it to be about right up in here so i'm gonna pull it through yeah i'm gonna keep it like that and then I'm gonna pull it through again. In there. So it can kind of like latch on, if you will. Up, oh, this came off. Okay, so I have it in here. 
I'm about to try to just like tie it. <sighs> it's about 4 30, 4 40. I'm about to go ahead and start on my makeup. Um, just about to clean up my eyebrows and stuff really quickly. Uh, um, fresh face, put on a little bit of primer, and yeah, that's what we're doing right now. I lay my edges down very briefly. I probably let them sit for maybe like two minutes, not gonna lie. Um, because I kind of want to do my makeup first and then I'll kind of redo the edges and everything like that. <laughs> so, this little tool is from Revline, and this is what I use to clip up uh, my eyebrows. <laughs> So I'll like raise the hair up. Um, this was sent to me for like a review as well. So I don't know if they, you know, still got this or what, but it literally just clips the hair. So basically it's like mini scissors, but they kind of look like tweezers, if you will. My boyfriend is not here. He left at about three o'clock. Said he was gonna be back at 4.30, but it's 4.30. So he said he out ripping and running, doing, I guess, little last minute stuff for my birthday and whatnot. My dinner is at 7.30. I think I told y'all we're going to go eat at Sullivan Steakhouse. I think I told y'all that. Um, so, yeah, it's going to be me, Bay, my cousin, Dinah, um, my friend, De'Ara, and her boyfriend, Josh, who's also my friend. <laughs> we all work together. And then my other friend and co-worker, Janae. Hopefully, her daughter is running a fever still, so hopefully she'll be able to come. And yeah, it's supposed to be Donna's best friend as well, but I think she has to work or something, I think she told me. So yeah, just the immediate people. And I haven't had a chance to reply back to anybody DM. I think I replied back to like two people when I was in the car on the way to Hot Springs to go get my massage. And I haven't literally replied back at all. We went dress shopping, but ultimately, I should have just ordered a dress from Old Polly. Um, their dresses are expensive, but they're always really, really nice quality. And you basically get what you pay for. They're really, really nice. Um, I do have an Old Polly dress that I could have worn. Um, it looks just like my dress from last year. It's just a longer version of it. And it's no cleavage. And it's long sleeve as well. But... Since it is longer and long sleeve, I feel like it's a little bit too hot for that. It's literally like 98 degrees, almost 100 degrees today. So yeah, we're not going to do that. But um, yeah, I really, really love Old Polly for birthday dresses. Um, so anything that has really, really good quality like them, I do recommend. We did go to the mall. I don't know if I'm going to put all those videos in or not. I saw like two dresses that I liked, but ultimately they did i mean they could have worked if i didn't just absolutely have nothing but they did kind of look a little cheap some of them like two of them were pretty okay but other than that i just feel like yeah no so the stuff that i have here um to me seems like better quality my best friend said that as well so we're just gonna rock out with what i got like i said i really wasn't putting too much thought into this birthday because nothing was going um as planned so i didn't have like you know a birthday outfit already picked out because everything that i had planned for my birthday was not working out and i'm using this eyebrow pencil from um benefit i guess it's like the benefit brow pencil if you will and i really like it i used to use the anastasia beverly hills um dip brow promade which i still like that as well but to me it's a little bit bold if you are looking for a bolder eyebrow but some people you know everybody got what they like um i still like it but i definitely kind of like the pencil a little bit better when i started out doing makeup i think i used to use um a brow pencil as well so we're not gonna do too much because i can just clean up my eyebrows with concealer and carve them how i want so that's why i don't care how the way i'm buffing the eyebrows out because I'm just going to, you know, calm it out. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah. yeah. Sometimes we laugh, sometimes we cry, but I guess you know now. Yeah. Baby. Yeah. I took a half and she took the whole thing. Slow down. I already, I already showed y'all all my other gifts, so we about to just start these. I'm hot. It's the drinks. The mind your background. Keep it in the sun. I was asking Oh my god. 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 O
Joshua, please Sorry. let me live. Oh my gosh! Damn, bro, it's one of those crazy. I was actually thinking about one of them the other day. I was like, yeah, I because I need it for the cruise and everything that we got coming up. Period. I thought somebody. I just asked to get a plug. We did one. Um, well, we used Taylor's. Yeah, yeah. We did Taylor's. Yeah. You say you wanted one. Yes. Look at you, a man that listen. Period. Hello. Come down. Oh, I know what this is. <laughs> uh -oh. Oh, wow. I know what this is. Right, that's the one you were talking about at work. Yes, that I was showing you. Is it the yes. tabby? Yes. Oh, oh my God, yes. Oh, that is so love cute. It is she want it? Yes. Oh, oh, she wants the black and the denim. Oh, it's so cute. I want <laughs> denim for sure. Oh, yes. Yeah. Oh, you did good. Oh yeah, you did good. Baby. I'm in my coach phase right now too. Thank you. Beautiful. Thank you. Love to see it. This is cute. What's yours? How much yours? Thirty. Forty. Oh wow. Well. Oh, what was hers? Yours was only thirty. Well, she didn't get no mac and cheese either, so that's probably why. But it's gonna be breakfast. <laughs> oh, we gotta stop at the gas station. Omg! Oh, 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 I love it. Love, love, love. You still got the box? Am I? I don't know. If so, what is it, what is if it? so, can I get it for an unboxing? I think it was for us. Yep. to see say black and tan why does it look gray and green this why how does that look i'm not talking about hanging it up the colors Ooh, you should have bought this one all right, so I'm about to go ahead and hang one of these up or two of these up just to see how they look actually hung up. Um, they still got like the little plastic and stuff on it. I don't really want to take that off yet. So I'm just going to poke a hole right here in the back of this one and 
screw it and put it on the wall with the long screw. Second one, now we're about to put the other one up over here. I'm gonna show y'all a little bit better, probably at nighttime. I like filming at night because the light just be messing me up, but it don't look too bad. I'm gonna keep it for now. Um, cause I mean, it is mostly black. So I need to figure out how I want them to hang though, because do I want them to be opposite or do I want that bigger piece to be kind of up on that side like that one? This one is up a little bit higher, so I do need to bring it down just a little bit. And then I feel like it'll be fine. And then I'm going to put the lights on top of it as well. God, oh. Yeah, that one definitely looks lower. OMG. I'm just going to raise this one up a little bit because I'm tired of drilling holes on that side. Hey there, I just realized that I did not close out this vlog. I'm sorry, but I did set up my picture frames. Um, I ended up deciding on keeping them. I'm recording off my iPhone, so sorry for the quality, but I decided to go ahead and keep them. Um, this is how they look. This is how they look. I like them. So yeah, don't forget to like this video, comment, and subscribe. And until my next one, I will see you love these things.